we can spend the night inside there. Hope I don't get caught. Man, I can't believe we're doing this right now. No joke, there's a cop car outside. But they're about to come in now. Do you have your ID on you? Oh, uh, yes sir, I'm, I mean ma'am. What's up guys, welcome back. I'm walking to this fine financial institution so I can get some money because I'm going to buy a sleeping bag off someone from Craigslist. I promised I was gonna meet her a little bit earlier, but you know, some bad things happened at work and then some good things happened, then more bad things happened, so it ended up being bad. So that's why I got out a little bit later than usual. Um, anyway, we'll get on into it. It's less sketchy than it sounds, but uh, we'll get on in here. Ooh, fancy in here. Donate at this ATM to help people affected by Hurricane Zeta. Too bad, I'm not a nice person. Insert card. Okay. And English. Yeah, I confirm it. Well, I mean, it's a credit card. There's no, there's no pin number to it. Cancel. Um, am I missing something? My card stuck in there. Oh, I see it. What? Where's the abort button? Abort. Oh no. That's not very good. It's like making a weird noise in there. Hear it? You can see it. Well, I don't know if you can see it in there actually. Darn, I don't know how I'm gonna get that out. Well, this isn't very good. Oh, look at this. It says this ATM will currently close. Oh gosh, hopefully it doesn't close with my card in it. That's not good. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Well, I can't just leave it in there, I don't think. Uh, I am actually pretty stumped. Let's see if there's any numbers on the side of this thing where the actual main Wells Fargo is right here. It says this branch is closing too. Oh my goodness, is Wells Fargo going out of business? Is it going out of business with my card inside of its ATM? Man. Oh my gosh, I knew I should have went to the safe. Knew I should have went there. My goodness, this one probably wouldn't have ate my freaking card. But no, that's what you get for going to big banks. Say the little community credit unions. There's only two options here. I can leave my card in there to get stolen by hoodlums and all my money drained. Or we could do the Ties Adventures way and we can spend the night inside there. Which I think would be pretty cool. But the only problem is this area is highly patrolled, if you know what I'm saying. Let me go look at it again. I think I think it's just I think it's just a fluke. It's a fluke. There is no way it is stuck in there. Oh my goodness. We're going to very sneakily and stealthily spend the night here. Just like what I said, the only thing is this place is uh kind of heavily patrolled, so I don't know what what does it do if we get in trouble? I mean, I am a member of this fine financial institution, so I mean, I'm allowed in there. I'm not trespassing. It's just I don't know if they allow camping. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Should be fun. As always, I do have all my camping stuff in my car ready to go at a moment's notice. You never know when you might need to tie adventures yourself into something or out of something or you know, spend the night somewhere where you didn't expect to. All right, so this person, I'm not gonna show you their number because that's not very nice, but they're getting kind of antsy pants. They're like, we're meeting, so we're gonna meet at Walmart. I'm like, okay, sounds good. And then around uh, seven-ish, right? So they're like, are you coming? Where are you? And I'm like, I'm stuck at work. How much longer? I'm like, maybe 30 minutes. <laughs> I thought, and then like, okay, where are you? How much longer? I'm just gonna say, Dude, period. My card got stuck in the ATM when I tried to get cash out, period. It's still stuck. I'm not sure when we can meet. 
boom. Sent that, see what they say. Oh, jerk. It's okay to say you're not interested. Damn, and they did the wrong kind of year. So they're not very smart. Darn, they got me. Exposed to the max that I'm not interested in a piece of outdoor gear. Let me tell you, they do not know Ty's Adventures. Anyway, it's, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'll just spend the night in here, lonely, without a nice sleeping bag. I still have nice sleeping bags, but yeah, this is gonna be awkward. Hope I don't get caught. Man, I can't believe we're doing this right now. Stoop to a low, low level. But it's good because I got all my camping stuff in here. I forgot. Hello. My sleeping bag. Oh, this is great. I even have my lunch from work that I didn't eat because it was a rough day today. Man, doesn't that sandwich look extra edible? Yummy. That's healthy. Eat that later once you get all set up. So since this is heavily patrolled, what I'm gonna do is um, if the cops come, which is highly likely, I'm gonna stand up, which is gonna be extra suspicious and pretend I'm using the ATM. It should be a fun one, so watch till the end. Might be sooner than later, so. I'm trying to stay behind this little wall so I can lay as flat as possible, but um, I'm not sure if that's gonna work right. Nice little pillow right here. It's looking pretty good, pretty good. Oh yeah. So I guess since I'm in here, I might as well eat my lunch or dinner at this point. But I was thinking of something that um, if I get caught in here, which is highly likely, um, I would say that I'm raising awareness for homeless veterans, which um, I feel like people can get behind around here. If that doesn't work, then I don't think I'm trespassing because I'm allowed to be here. And uh, seeing how my card's in there, they stole from me, it's really theft. The only thing they could probably get me on is like camping, but I'm not really camping, I'm just waiting for my card to come out, which could be overnight, so who knows. Don't eat my sandwich, so I might as well crack open a cold in. Good old fashioned Coke never let you down either. This road out here is like a main thoroughfare. I'm kind of glad that there really hasn't been a lot of cars going through here. It's actually really hard to see out of here, which is not working to my advantage. So uh, I see a lot of my reflections, but I can only see like light if it's outside. Let me tell you about the sleeping bag I was going to buy. It was a North Face sleeping bag, which is, you know, a higher end brand. It was originally a $300 sleeping bag but on Craigslist, it said they only used it a couple times and they had it listed for $180. <coughs> Excuse me, this is really getting to me. And um, I was gonna, you know, offer less. It's a synthetic sleeping bag. And the thing about sleeping bags is down can be a lot warmer, but if it gets wet, it loses its insulation value. But synthetic, which is the one I was gonna buy, it, is, it was a negative 20 degree sleeping bag, so it was just way cold enough for anything I'm gonna camp in, but it was synthetic. So even if it gets wet, it still keeps its insulating values, which is a little fact for down versus synthetic. This sleeping bag is a synthetic sleeping bag, uh, zero degree, but I was gonna upgrade a little bit more to a negative 20. Mm. Can't tell if that's a car out there just sitting there watching me. Maybe they're, they're afraid to use the ATM because I'm in here. It doesn't work anyway, so I mean, they, they wouldn't get anything out of it. So I'm gonna see what it looks like from the outside. Oh. Don't mind me, fair citizens. And it, uh, yeah, it's pretty sus right there. I'm not, not gonna lie. So, um, yeah. I'll probably get in trouble later, but it's fine. It'd be great. You can go ahead and use it. I'm just trying to raise awareness for homeless veterans. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> Little does he know, the card machine does not work. Oh, he's tapping at it right now. He's trying to get it to work. <laughs> I mean, I shouldn't make fun. My card is in there. Hopefully it doesn't come out and he takes it. 
I don't think he will though. There he goes, leaving moneyless. And without his lights on, that's nice. All right, so I've been in here for a couple hours now. And I'm actually thoroughly surprised. I've not come in contact with any law enforcement entities. Just nice uh, people who want to use the ATM, but obviously it's broken. So they're actually working out pretty good, but knock on wood, we don't get arrested tonight. I mean, that's my right. We're not gonna get arrested. I mean, that guy bought, we're raising awareness for homeless veterans, like, ice cream on a hot day. Mm-hmm. There's been some more activity. There's been a lot of uh, fair citizens driving around recently. And um, some of them have been driving by pretty slowly, so I don't want them to alert any kind of uh, police to my location. So I retreated to outside of the little primitive jail cell there. Knock on wood, I actually don't go to jail. Whoa, look at this giant bug on the side of the ATM. Oh gosh, here it is now. Oh, it's like a grasshopper. Nice. All right, so I'm pretty sure the coast is clear now. There hasn't been a lot of cars in a while. It's also going on 11 o'clock too. That's kind of past my bedtime. I know I'm excited, I know I just drank a Coke too. I'm gonna get on in here and this is actually a time when I wish I wore my face mask, but not for my face, for my eyes. Because it's pretty bright in here. Yeah, this might be a long night. I have to like cover my head in here. A little cocoon. Don't mind me, fair citizens. Oh gosh, they're stopping hardcore. <laughs> All right, so I just woke up to the sound of car door shutting and no joke, there's a cop car outside. So um, I'm gonna keep you guys hidden and uh, so they don't take my camera, but they're about to come in now. What's going on here? Hey, uh, sir, I'm just here trying to raise some awareness for uh, homeless veterans. So, uh, I mean, that's why, I mean, I got my sleeping bag in here and um, it looks like I'm camping, but I'm really not, so I mean. Do you have your ID on you? Oh, uh, yes, sir, I mean, ma'am. Um, here you go, let me. Wait, you're not actually spending the night, right? No, uh, no, no, man. I'm not. I'm not spending the night. I'm just like I said. I'm just trying to raise some awareness for uh, homeless veterans, and you know, it's it's a big deal that you know, a lot of people get out of the military and they you know have nowhere to go, no no options or anything like that. So, I'm just I'm just here trying to do that. I mean, I'm not obviously not spending the night. It looks like it. I mean, you mm -hmm. know, but yeah, that's what it looks like. But if you're just gonna be here. How long do you think you're gonna be here for? Oh, I mean, maybe like five, ten minutes more. Okay. Um, well, whenever you're done, pack up. Oh, y y yes, ma'am. Yeah, right. for sure. All right. You have a good night. All right. Have a good one, guys. Have you too. So they, um, they told me to move along. They're actually sitting right over there. Uh, those are their headlights right there. Watching them make sure I left. They're probably getting pissed that I'm walking back towards this. I'm also not really sure what's gonna happen to my card that's in here because it's still in there. They were really nice. They were probably obviously concerned that I was in there with a sleeping bag and whatnot and didn't really care that I was raising awareness for homeless veterans, but that's besides the point. Hope one day they are not homeless. They didn't give me a ticket or anything like that. So um, that's nice. So we'll be at it again. Not here though, not here. And if you guys cops are watching, um, not here, not here, but um, yeah, cops are good, so if you see a cop, thank them for their service too. Um, and uh, sorry this one got cut short really quick, but uh, do all that fun YouTube stuff, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that awesome stuff, and we'll definitely see you in the next one. Out.